on deck is Brooke Akuli, and our next uh, pitcher is Lucy Friedland. Oh, great, good, yeah. okay, yes, there you go. So you want to go now or am I on deck? No, uh, Lucy, is, is Lucy? No, 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 I wrote on there I was going to do it by email. Oh, okay, sorry, go ahead, yes, you're up, okay. go ahead, sorry, yeah. sorry about that, yes. No okay. You can crumple that up. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who could you create out of chaos? How a real-life hurricane became my eat, pray, love. And as my kids say, you can't poke a hole in the truth, and you can't make this shit up. <laughs> Following Florida's Hurricane Charlie in 05, and immediately following a three-month-long separation, it would take five years of food, wine, and travel, a journey of serendipity, self-discovery, and a 3,000 move across the country with 10 boxes, nothing to lose and everything to gain. In search of adventure, new recipes, back roads, and an earthquake, this book could fit into perhaps any genre, any genre with the exception of self-help, since you'll have to choose your own ending, just like before you knew anything. It's like being in your own video game, and you get the prizes for each chapter you dare to write for yourself. Um, in an economy with, uh, that we have going on, I left a $200,000 a year job, moved here with nothing, landed in San Francisco with um, basically what I had on my back, and uh, run and operate a soup, soup cart in the city here, and have a blog called soupslut.com. She's a soup lady. I am. For real. Yes. <laughs> I'm on the way there tonight. I had to come here first. <laughs> So yes, I'm working on fitting things we in. We apologize. We are we run we a jam the every second Tuesday of the month at El Rio, the bar. It's a wonderful bar, and we we do a jam session there. And the soup woman always comes at the end of our jam. Yes, soup woman. Yes. You should come sooner. Um, it, it, all of this sounds like very interesting territory, but I didn't get uh, any spe real specifics in it. So you did the good like uh, movie trailer overarching themes, but I needed a little bit more uh, specificity in there. And the other thing is there's a lot of cliches in that pitch. So like nothing to, nothing to lose and everything to gain. However, what I loved is when you said, this is every genre but self-help. That's original and interesting to me. So I lose the cliches and get more specific in your voice. Thank you. Um, I, I just want to say we really do need to know the genre if you're pitching to a publisher. They're, they're going to want to know how immediately what you are. Okay. And I didn't get that sense from your pitch. Okay. But we love you, Sue. <laughs> <laughs> you can get some tonight. All of you. <laughs> you're done here. Yeah. <laughs> At the LVM. <LU. laughs> Thank you very much.